Okay, here we go. Welcome back to some more Final Fantasy VII Remake. Hope you all are doing well and having a great week and that you have a great weekend. Remember to subscribe, hit that like button, enable notifications and leave me a comment. So continuing from right where we start off, we left off, sorry, and continuing with the story. All right, there it is. The gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time Up for... Up there looks nice. <sighs> Come on! time ago I used to sell flowers here oh yeah <sighs> so cloud you were a soldier first class right yeah Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. <sighs> What's his name? I probably know him. Are you okay? Oh. Wow. Uh. Your eyes. Oh. It's because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm bumming you out. We should go. <sighs> Gotta look forward, not back. I wanna know what's the name that you said, but there's something weird going on here. And it's like a real interesting kind of story. Uh, just for intersex, if you want to see child's, uh, Cloud's inner child, just over here. <laughs> so if you talk to Aerith, you progress the story. So I'm going to look around first. There's a chest. I think that's all you can do over here. Play with the swings if you want. And you can't even go further than that. Okay, so you're now going to get the first glimpse of the dress that you chose for Tifa when you chose there in chapter 3, I think it is, um, where you chose either the normal. I don't know what the first one is, the casual, I think, uh, sporty, and then exotic. Now, I chose exotic on this playthrough, 
so we'll see what it looks like. I think with my playthrough with this one, I'll probably show you all three of the top tier dresses. Okay, so let's continue. Here. Hmm? This won't take long. <sighs> Ready. <sighs> Want to get to Sector 7 in style? This is the passageway for you. gonna be okay getting home and if I said I wasn't I'll go with you I thought you needed to get back <sighs> don't worry I have a backup route for emergencies and it's safer too Guess this is it then. Ready? Let's go. Yeah. Uh -huh. Lost you. What's going on? Shh. I'll explain everything later. But now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo. You should head back to Seventh Heaven, meet up with the gang. But I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick? I have. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Oh, no, you don't. You're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. And where is she going to meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. Come on. Aren't you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her. <sighs> Come on! Okay. Come on, Cloud! We gotta hurry! Okay, and there's... Let's go rescue Tifa. And like I say, you get a little glimpse of what the dress looks like. But it's kind of silly, like Aerith just left your group and now she's back in it. <laughs> I don't, I don't really understand what was the idea behind that. But okay, so this is now the city that never sleeps or something, Walmart, uh, the wall market. Uh, just for intersex, this is where you get the third dress, depending on what you do. If you don't do any side quest or one or two side quests, then you get the normal dress. Uh, and the second and third one depends on whether you do Chocobo Sam's, which you'll need now, his questline, or um, Madam M's. Now, I'll explain along the way which choice is which, and as soon as you start, you're going to meet Johnny again. You can either follow him and have him with you, or... Just ignore him, but I'll follow him and like get the side quest thing for him and follow his way, see if I still get it. I'm probably going to try and get the most 
high tier one for this dress as well. Now, I just want to say you're going to talk to Choco Sam when, as soon as you do, when you do get a choice. That's one of the choices where you, if you're trying to, I don't want to call it romance, but if you're romancing or going on a date with Tifa, then this is one of the choices. Uh, the one I'm going to choose is the one for it. If you don't want to romance her, then you choose one of the other ones. to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little... What's all the ruckus out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl of yours? Guess. We want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what's she look like? Well... Okay, she's in great shape is the one you want if you want to drive as default. She's in great shape. Is that really important? Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. Oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Having scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon. If at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? <laughs> what are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. <sighs> And there goes our best lead yet. <clears throat> Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. By the way, that guy's voice sounds familiar. I think I'll look it up and put it in the description, but I know him from the, the Nicolas Cage Ghost Rider, where he plays the caretaker of the cemetery it sounds like him so like i said i'll see if it is him that's the voice actor okay so just look back here this delivery isn't due for inspection there's a huh? test these ones addressed to don corneo yes it is <laughs> Welcome to Walmart, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. So, what kind of mischief you looking to get up to tonight? You gotta let go of your inhibitions and set yourself free. Indulge your wildest fantasies. What happens here stays here. After all, baby, you're in Wall Market. That's just how we do. So, what kind of mischief you looking to get up to tonight? Check this out. This is hilarious. Step right up, step right up. It's a fully automated it looks like one of those claw things or something. Oh. 
Maybe it's broken? <laughs> That's a mini guy that's shooting at you. But anyways, the funny thing is, he's not, no, he is the owner. Any item you can think of, just a button push away. We'll give these a grand opening disc huh? Everything. What's that? Well, not working, right. you say? Huh. Maybe there's something wrong with the wiring. Huh? It shot you? Well, that's not good for business. This is for wiring must Payment be faulty or something. Can't fork over the gill and someone else huh? gets the spot. What's that? Not working, you say? Fierce, hey, huh. Okay, then there's the inn, by the way. This is if you're trying to romance Aerith. I'm just going to call it romance. I, that's the nearest thing I've got for it. Or make a, a, approval higher or something. Uh, so if you choose no thanks, then it's where you get her approval. And the other ones I don't think so much. You two. Yes, you. Do you have a place to stay this enchanted evening? We have the perfect room for a sweet looking couple like you. See, no thanks is for Aerith. I'm just going to pick how much just because how I'm much? trying with T5. <laughs> just give me a holler when you change your mind. No preferences we can't accommodate. No, sir. Hey, hey, hey! If you're looking for the most unforgettable night of your life, look no further. Enjoy a sleepless night in the city true to its name. A sleepless night. Come on, you guys. Let's check out the town. Okay, well, you can go in here. Um, this is if you want to sleep, you can actually rest here. You know, I've heard from more than a few people that my son Johnny has been roaming the streets of Wall Market. Before he leaves town, I need to make sure I deliver him his lucky pillow. I have faith in my boy, of course. But a growing man needs plenty of sleep. Sleep of good quality, no less. That's how mind and body stay healthy and active. In other words, this pillow is crucial to his health. <laughs> my wife is back in Sector 7. I thought it best she wait for me there because the establishments in this town are uh, provocative. <laughs> Of course, I haven't been to any myself, so I don't know what goes on around here. Not in the slightest. <laughs> well, that Johnny and his father seem both like idiots. Now, if you want to check in here, there's a chest. And if you do the choke of a Sam quest, then you want to get to this thing at one stage. You can go in here, but there's oh, nothing. Shit. Just asleep or something. NPCs talking. Oh, this is what I get for being a cheapskate. A room with a fool again. Don't know about you, but this place sure is a lot weirder than I thought it'd be. Yeah? What did you expect? You know, something less. Uh. The arrows isn't even coming in. <laughs> oh, wow. Would you forget you guys? Oh, the sights, the sounds. One more. This is where they said to Relaxation, the sweet embrace of pretty ladies. Oh, that's what I need. or not to enter that is the question wherefore does this philosophical quandary torment me you totally get where i'm coming from right 
I've got no idea what the choice makes here. Yeah, I should have figured. You're not the philosophical introspective type like me. That soft, naive face. I know you're kind well, bro. You're just another muscle head who uses violence to work through your inner demons. It's sad, really. Huh? Yeah, what's up? Seen Tifa around? Tifa? My love? My light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up. I don't care. Tifa's here? Why? Tell me why! Oh god, no. I did this to her, didn't I? She came looking for me to beg me not to leave her. <gasps> Snap out of it, Johnny. Your Tifa needs you. Tifa, I'm coming, baby. Who was that? Nobody you want or need to know. I feel like Cloud do. So you run up to him and like you saw, he's got the circle above his head and on the map so you can find him. You're not gonna see a show and then just follow him to here and talk to him. Else. Now, I don't know what the difference is between those choices, if there is a difference or not. Uh, while we are here, just go in here. And then back here. What? Uh, aren't you that leaf house? Uh, hey, what the hell, Merc? Digging into people's personal affairs in this town is a huge no-no. What are you doing here? Well, if you must know, I've wanted to be a dancer ever since I was a little girl. I come here at night to live the dream. I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell the children, okay? I practice every second I can. It's the only way I'll become the best. So like I said, when we did it, when we did the side quest and stuff with, and talked to Miss Viola, like I said, you should pay attention to her look and her, what she's saying. I practice every second I can. It's the only way I'll become the best. I just think that's some kind of funny side info or stuff. Gotta stay sharp though. Lifetime bans or lifetime bans. Maybe I'll find somebody who was right. As if you're not here to you know, you can go around and explore the place, but I'll do that in another video. And not, uh, yes, is it? Place is really confusing. Okay, so one of the first things you want to do when you're here is... Up here, there's the weapon shop. Next to the end, that's the owner's brother. Yeah, oh, nothing here. But there's bad blood between them. Heard they had a falling out over a tank or some shit. Ah, so they're both collectors. That feud's got to run deep. Welcome to Wall Market's premier weapon shop. Okay, and then at the weapons, there's Hard Edge, new sword for Cloud. Um, huh. that old dude in the vacant lot next to the oh, and the new the upgraded version, super, see Supernatural Risk Cards, I'm going to buy one, and the Time Worn Talisman is the upgrade for Aerith. Do come again. So let's equip it quickly or upgrade it. Uh, cloud. Okay, so no. Material slot for this one yet. That's pretty cool as well, especially with cloud. Since you, if you 
do you you'd go into special mode if you just press triangle So for the moment, I'm going to have one less material slot. Mm, there. Okay, fire. Probably going to remove barrier for the moment. Strike a staggered enemies to get the bonus for it. Damn. Sure hope that lasts. Okay, so then just go up here to Corneo's. Check it out. Uh I think we might have found our man. And he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Okay, then before you go in, just look around, like you see there's a chest over there. 1,200 gil. And back here as well. An ether! You can look here, but there's nothing over here on this side as well. Uh, with these doors, they hold triangle. I have a tendency to just press triangle and then I have to do it again. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Wall Market. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the Don's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute. Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. If you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're going to need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honey Bee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. If you're hell bent on getting in, then go bother the trio. If you're hell bent on getting in, then go bother the trio. I love that part. <laughs> Aerith's like permission to kill. <laughs> Denied. I so say the thing, the story is very funny. The people, the, I'd like their sense of humor. It's interesting. Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas... Not really. So that's the way it is. Hmm. 
Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. I'm going to Chocobo Sam first. Okay, so this is a, one of the first choices that determine if you're going to do Chocobo Sam's quest line or or uh, Madam M's. Uh, you can't do both of them in one playthrough. You, you after the new game plus you can redo chapters and stuff so then you can do it if you want you should have known better always go with your gut okay so he's gonna do a coin toss if you pick either heads or tails you're playing it if you say no thanks uh, no thanks is if you want to go with madam m Playing is if you want to go with Chocobo Sam's, but we're going with Madam M's at the moment. Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, hear us out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time we'll be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Guess right, and I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> Guess wrong, and you'll leave me in peace. No thanks. Oh, not a gambler, huh? I am! Heads! Huh? Hmm? Hmm. Uh -huh. Tail, you lose. Uh. Hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. Uh. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio and not just the Mio. Now skedaddle. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? Hmm. <sighs> Trick coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating! And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. I like arrows there, just like I have heads. So it doesn't matter if you put it at big heads or tails, you lose. But anyway, so let's continue with the next one. Come on, you guys. Let's see. Um. Hey, I'm talking to you. I Don't said they're believe I swear. Oh, this place is full up too. There's something downright wrong with this place. Sick. 
Like I said, I get confused in this place. Oh, here I am. Okay. This the place? I wanted to see Andrea. Think so. Curse my weak. Let me handle this. But you wait out here, okay? Then why would I do that? No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that. You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. She's got in there. If you see every time you get to a place, Johnny is stumbling out. Dejected. Deject so I, I mean, shit. <laughs> I have to admit, with a lot of these games, the content, the mature content, I don't know if I should like bleep out all the swearing. Like Spider-Man, this one, Gotham Knights. Good evening. Oh. Uh, hey, uh. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh. We don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required. And the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes. Well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare. But Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. Hey, are you nervous too? I know why you're here. This is it, your destination. Get what they deserve. Yeah, screw it. I'm getting the works. I'm gonna get an extra helping. Curse you, romance. Oh, why? Why must you make fools of us? How about one time? Johnny's been had. She's a siren, I tell you. My Gil. Oh, Johnny's been had. She's a siren, I tell you. Oh, there's this energy pulled. Okay, so here's the second choice where you choose whether you want to try and get Chocobo Sam's side quest or Madam M's. So when she asked for this a massage. When uh, she asks for the massage, you can, if you don't want, if you want to check over Sam's, you choose the cheap one. If you want That's her one, you choose the luxury one and make sure you've got 3,000 gil on you. <laughs> I'm a customer for life. <sighs> welcome, welcome. Just the two of you, step right up. Now then, what manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm-hmm. We are a hand massage parlor. An excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> and what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are 
Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don... Oh, for the love of... Say another word, and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Mm. Uh. Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well? <laughs> hmm. Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! The strong, firm hands of a fighter, yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? So, yes, we choose the luxury one or the poor one, depending on what dress you want, or if you want which one side quest you want. <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back and wait. Cloud? <laughs> this exclusive treatment is reserved for our most well-to-do patrons. I just hope this doesn't get copyright spiked. The hand cream. A generous coating for each and every one of your richly deserving fingers. Let's start with the tips. That's it. Relax. I'm only here to help. Oh, did that hurt? No. <laughs> then I'll move on to the base. Of the fingers. Let's see if we can't improve your circulation. Get that blood flowing. <laughs> no, don't fight it. Stress is poison to the body. And finally, some gentle stimulation for the palm. No more than a touch. Just like this. Oh, what was that? A cry of pleasure? Is this how you like it? How about this? Or maybe this? <laughs> if that was to your liking, do come again. Right. How was it? Huh? You okay? Yeah. You're acting weird, Cloud. I am? Really weird. Hmm. Think you'll make a habit of it? Then, I think I've seen everything I need to see. So? Tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. Cloud is completely stunned. The hilarious one is if you take the cheap one, she like almost breaks your hand. Sure you're okay? Yeah. Sure you're okay? Yeah. Like I said, I just hope that's not some other virtue violation there. <laughs> You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm. Okay. Really? But you cannot go dress like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate wearing such a plain looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. 
Is something wrong with my outfit? This is another Tifa suggestion. Uh, if you want uh, Tifa, it's a uh, matter what I think. It matter what I think? Well, I think it's pretty cool. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. There any prize money? <laughs> yes, for the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. Okay, so that is, like I say, if you want to um, romance Erif, then you choose It's Alright. If you want to romance Tifa, you choose that. What Does It Matter, I think. What have we gotten ourselves into? Nothing good. I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town. Think we can win it all? That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. I appreciate the confidence, just don't get too cocky, okay? Okay, that's gonna be it for this video. Next one we'll go to the Colosseum and take part in the tournament. Hope you're enjoying. I'm enjoying. It's pretty cool. Have a great day. See you in another video.